The Royals in crisis. The princess out of hiding, and Prince William breaking his silence. Well, kind of. Good to see you. And you, welcome. Exactly 50 days after his wife Kate's surprise abdominal surgery, Prince William is speaking out about all the crazy conspiracy theories over her health crisis. But he's the future king, so he doesn't say it. His spokesperson does. His focus is on his work and not on social media. That quote in the new People magazine cover story exposing what's going on behind palace walls. The fact that we heard from the palace and in response to a lot of the conspiracy theories it shows that they, they see what's being said out there. If you ask members of the royal family right now, they will feel that they are actually being quite transparent about what's going on with their health issues. While William continues to make appearances, even hanging out with actor Rob McElhaney at Wrexham, the Welsh football club that Rob owns with Ryan Reynolds, he has yet to address his wife's condition in public, even though reporters have asked him how she's doing. We know that Kate has um, had a call for privacy, and a lot of that stems from her wish to protect her young children. The fact that people uh, is hearing that there is radio silence around Kate's condition, that really points to um, there really is such a tight inner circle that really knows um, about Kate's condition, and that even those closest to them working within the palace don't know. Maybe the biggest surprise about all this royal drama? It does not involve Harry and Meghan. Harry just scored some PR points rushing back to the UK to see King Charles after his dad's cancer diagnosis, telling GMA about his whirlwind trip. How did you get the news that the king was ill? Um, I spoke to him. And what did you do next? I jumped on a plane and, and went to go see him as soon as I could. In the next few days, the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle, will be a keynote speaker at the famed South by Southwest conference alongside Katie Couric and Brooke Shields. And with the rift between Harry and Will still a big issue, the Duke of Sussex has another opportunity to mend fences in May. He'll return to the UK for the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games. People's hearing from sources that it's going to take a lot for William. There's a lot of mistrust there on his side when it comes to his brother, and um, that he would need a clear apology to move forward. The new issue of People is staring at you at the checkout stand Friday.